Hey there. So um, this is going to be a, a regular update on our uh, process here at the forward site in Sido Harjo, Indonesia. And uh, since since the publication of the book, we have been continuing our research in, in various on, on various processes of the of the BSF uh, waste treatment technology. But uh, what I want to discuss a little bit today is about the the post processing trial. So. Um, in the book, we already described the option of uh, post-processing the larvae and producing uh, pellets out of that. So the pelletizing process itself doesn't take very long. We have a, a mixture step where we mix the larvae uh, with the rice husk. And this mixture is then fed into the pelletizer. And the pelletizer has uh, multiple functions. So first of all, it, it, uh, it kills the larvae and it then mixes the larv larval content together with the, with the rice husk, with the dry rice husk, to press out um, a long slide of, of pellet. And this is then dried out in the sun for, uh, for about uh, two days, which means that it's about two times uh, eight hours in, in, in sunlight. Um, and after that, uh, after that process, we have these, as you can see, we have these hard, hard pellets, which, which have a water content of around between 10 and 15% and can therefore be stored for a longer time in a, in a, in a bag. Uh, and these pellets then can, for, can function as a feedstuff for either direct feeding mixed with, with regular feed or as a base material for further processing. Thank you for watching this video. If you're interested in the content, be sure to visit the AOWAC website and also visit our Facebook page.